was a romantic affair behind the stabbing death earlier this spring of the founder of Cash App. Tech entrepreneur Bob Lee was stabbed late at night in San Francisco and later died of his injuries. And according to a bombshell report, the suspect's sister and the victim were an item on an underground party scene. There are shocking new allegations about tech tycoon Bob Lee's murder. The Wall Street Journal says Lee was an active participant in an underground sex and drug circle known as The Lifestyle. And he was allegedly joined by this woman, Kazar Momeni, the sister of the man accused of stabbing him to death. Kazar's steely beauty struck observers at her brother's court appearance. Her husband is a prominent San Francisco plastic surgeon. Her brother allegedly killed Lee after an argument over whether his sister and Lee were doing anything inappropriate. Lee is the founder of Cash App, the popular cell phone payment app. According to the Wall Street Journal, Kazar and Lee were both involved with the secretive group, The Lifestyle. The secret society is reminding many of the Tom Cruise movie, Eyes Wide Shut. That's right. That is the password. Were you shocked to learn that Bob Lee was sort of living this double life? Absolutely. I mean... He did not keep his partying and his even his recreational drug use a secret, but no one was really in that really underground scene that he was in. He was the kind of guy where everyone would go home at midnight after a few drinks, and then he would be out all night until 8 a.m. The suspect's attorney is urging patience. The facts as to what occurred or did not occur will come out. According to the autopsy, Bob Lee had cocaine and ketamine, a high-power tranquilizer, in his system when he was killed. When you read about it, you sort of see scenes from that movie Eyes Wide Shut. It does seem a little bit like that, and it's a scene that is just so foreign to most of us, even those of us living in the city. So it's a little hard to wrap your head around. An attorney for the suspect sister says there are many rumors circulating around this case, and many are untrue. Meantime, Bob Lee's widow denies he was involved in those underground parties. The suspect is due in court Thursday. His lawyer says he'll be pleading not guilty.